Oh, my nice to uh, start with then. Welcome back to Wales. What sort of nick are you in as a, a player at the moment after Pakistan? Um, I mean, it's just, for me, it's just taking it in, taking a couple of days. Obviously, Pakistan was a great trip for us as a, as a team. Um, you know, not only you know did we come away with the T20 victory, we were very close in the one day, and obviously got the got the Test victory in the 15th day of the series, which is amazing. Um, yeah, personally, I'm feeling in, in good touch. Obviously, um, would have liked, always would like more runs. I think doesn't matter how many runs you're scoring, you'd always like more. So, you're probably um, you know as a cricketer, you're never satisfied. Um, but you know, today was my first hit out um, again here in Cardiff and. Um, yeah, feeling great. Obviously, nice to touch base with Matt again, talk cricket, and, uh, and yeah, get back into it. What about uh, the transition then from Pakistani conditions to uh, presumably very different here in England and Wales? How do you how do you manage that transition? Yeah, I, I think for me, it, it sort of starts today. I had uh, probably five days off um, in between the the two tours, so uh, today and tomorrow is sort of my kickstart. And, and it's just touching base again with your technique, um, you know, the changes you, you need to make um, coming from, you know, wickets where there's no bounce, no swing, um, and no real seam. Um, so just making that transition, you know, you have to move your feet a little bit more. Um, yeah, just, and obviously just getting used to that ball shaping again and, and, and the ball lipping again and making sure that your, your technique and that your bat path and that, that the things that you hold, like, you know, to your core value is in good stead. And you've got so uh, five championship games, maybe a couple of T20 before Sri Lanka. What's your schedule like? Yeah, it sounds something like that. Maybe some of the seven T20. So um, it just depends on um, on on that tour to Sri Lanka and what that looks like um, and how early I need to join the squad over there. So. Um, that's yet to, to be determined. We've got some rough dates that we're working off, um, and that's where the sort of um, five and seven have, have come about. But we'll have to wait and see, and, and, and see an exact um, amount of T20s I'll play. But I'm really looking forward to to, to the T20 form. You mentioned uh, working with Matt Maynard again. You were very complimentary about him when you started here in in 2019. Useful to uh, get a pair of fresh eyes on things again. Yeah, I mean, we always stay in touch. Um, I'm always, you know, sending him stuff or we're talking about the game. So, you know, our relationship doesn't just sort of, um, doesn't just stay here. Um, you know, it, it, it's wherever I am. If I've got ideas or I feel like I need, um, you know, someone that I can lean on and talk cricket, um, he's, he's always one of my first calls. So, um, but it is nice to, 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 like you said, get a fresh pair of eyes and, and be able to, you know, just have a hit. And one of my favorite things to do is just having not many people around, you know, just you, you and a couple of people, just, it, it really gives you that clarity of mind and you can really immerse yourself in your thoughts and, and what you're trying to do in the game. First up uh, against Knotts at uh, Trent Bridge, likely that Stuart Broad will play for, for Knotts, having in, encountered him in the, uh, in the Ashes, of course, I mean, last season you came up against Jimmy Anderson in one of your early season matches. This time probably Stuart Broad. Looking forward to uh, doing battle with him again? Oh, absolutely. Um, yeah, it's so exciting to see these, um, you know, high quality players playing county cricket still. Um, you know, they've really shown their, obviously, their amazing careers in international cricket. Hopefully that continues for, for both of Jimmy and Broad. But, um, yeah, it's always nice to play them in. in everyone here, you know, it lifts the standard, it makes you a better player and um, yeah, I can't wait to, to get into the battle again. 